Hi, I'm Nathan Rodell from Hillsborough Schools Nutrition Services Department. Today we wanted to give you an overview of how students receive school lunch in our elementary schools. We take pride in the meals we're able to offer attending students. For some, the food they get at school is the most nutritious meal they will eat in a day. If you want more information about healthy eating, visit myplate.gov to learn more. Participating in school meals means we're providing vital nutrients to growing minds. I hope you'll choose to join us for breakfast and lunch. Welcome to Patterson Elementary School, home of the Panthers. The items listed on the cafeteria menu are categorized by the type of foods we are required to offer. Meat or meat alternate, grains, vegetables, fruits, and milk. You don't have to take everything that is offered, but you need to choose at least three servings of these food types on your tray to count as a complete lunch. And one of those items must be half a cup of fruit or vegetables. Now, let's see what it's like to go through the line. Before arriving at the cafeteria, students must find their card in the card rack located in the hallway or other designated area. Every HSD student has a unique card with a number on it. If you can't find your card, don't worry. Continue to go through the line and let the cashier know your card was not there. The lunch menu is posted on the bulletin board so you can see what is offered that day. If you want to see the menu ahead of time, menus for the whole month are posted online. Ask an adult to help you find them so you can see which days your favorite foods are being offered. Next, you will come to the milk cooler. There are two flavors to choose from, plain or chocolate. Now let's walk to the salad bar and grab your tray. Be sure to set your card on the top of the tray so it is easy for the cashier to take your card. Take whatever you like from the salad bar, just be careful not to take more than you can eat. Remember to take at least a half a cup of fruit or vegetable, about the size of a grade schooler's fist. Next, you will get to the main dish, or as we call it, the entree. There are usually three to four to choose from. Today we have chicken quesadillas, chicken burgers, or cheese stuffed sticks with marinara sauce. Choose the entree you want and put it on your tray. Remember, it's okay if you don't take everything that is offered. We want you to take what you want, but please be sure to eat what you take. On to the computer. The cashier will grab your card from the tray and swipe it through the card reader. If you could not find your card on the card rack, be sure to let the cashier know. Some schools may have you touch your photo on the screen rather than swipe your lunch card. Our cashiers are friendly and helpful and will make sure you have enough different types of food on your tray to count as a lunch. In the case they notice you do not have three items or if you are missing a fruit or a vegetable, you will be asked to go back and get what is necessary to make a complete meal. After you have everything on your tray and your card has been swiped, walk over to where the condiments, water, and utensils are. Once you have what you need, take your tray over to your class table and join your friends to eat. As you can see, buying lunch at school is super easy. If you have a food allergy, be sure to have your parent or guardian check the menu or call the school nutrition office or an assigned district nurse if you need help with information about ingredients or help with the best choices. Visit the district webpage and navigate to the Nutrition Services page for more information. Thank you and bon appétit.